Hello. We have found that, after all, there isn't a sharp line dividing humans from the rest of the animal kingdom, as we find animals doing things that we, in our arrogance, used to think was just human. I know that they share our emotions, pleasure, joy, sadness, fear. I knew there was deforestation going on around the park, but I was not prepared for the absolute devastation. I, I couldn't just stay in Gombe watching chimpanzees leading an idyllic life. I had to try and do whatever I could. But it's not really possible to think about conservation unless you bring the people into the picture. It's, it's where they live, after all. I'm very determined. <laughs> We here think globally, act locally, don't. If you think globally, you become filled with gloom. But if you take a little piece of this whole picture, my piece, our piece, this is what I can do here. I'm making a difference. And hi, wow, they're making a difference over there. And so are they, and so are they. And so gradually the pieces get filled in and the world is a better place because of you. In July 1960, Jane Goodall embarked on a remarkable adventure at the request of the British anthropologist, Dr. L.S. Healy.